Welcome back to Andy's Guides. In today's video, we are going to show you how to reset the chart to default layout in Trading View. Let's begin. Now, the first thing you need to do is to log in using your credentials. If this is your first time in Trading View, click the sign up option. And from here, just follow the on screen instructions and you're good to go. Resetting your trading view to the default layout can provide several practical benefits, especially if you've made numerous customizations or changes over time. Now, I need you to go to the uh, products, click on the super charts, and of course, choose the chart of your liking. Now, resetting to the default layout helps clutter or clear any clutter or unnecessary indicators and drawings that may have accumulated for in this case, I have done a lot here in my chart for several video tutorials. Now, the next thing that you need to do for you to be able to reset all of these, I simply need you to right click on the active screen and go to settings. Or you can go here at the bottom where you see the uh, like a uh, eye icon, click on that and click on settings. Now, you can also go to the upper right corner, same symbol, click on chart settings, click on template, and just click on the apply default, right? Click on OK. What will happen is you would be able to delete all of this that you wanted, remove, remove, and a lot more. Now, I'm going to switch over to the, uh, making it easier for us to follow. Just remove all of these, any clutter that you wanted. Because if you encounter performance issues, glitches, or unexpected behavior on your chart, resetting to the default layout can help resolve these problems. It helps eliminate any errors or conflicts caused by complex customizations or sometimes, you know, incorrect settings. A default layout can improve chart performance um, that... For example, uh, improves the loading times, especially if you have numerous indicators and drawing tools that you wanted to or is slowing down the uh, platform. It minimizes the lags and ensures smoother charting experience. So let me uh, remove all of this that we don't want here on our chart. All right. Remove drawings, remove indicators. It's up to you, right? You have to empty all of these. After that, return to the default, ensures you are using consistent and standardized view which can be helpful for routine analysis. And that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you again in the next one.